Allow me to begin with a quote by Ronnie Coleman, aka Black Jesus, aka Regular Jesus. Everybody wanna be a bodybuilder, but don't nobody wanna lift no heavy ass weight. Church. The same is true for deadlifts. Everybody wanna deadlift, but don't nobody wanna deadlift. Cause you don't wanna fuck up and look like a noob. The last thing you wanna do is approach the king of all exercises looking like a fucking peasant. This is where I come in. I'm gonna step into your ring and I'm gonna fuck you up with knowledge. Oh, what, Pellegrino? First step is whipping your dick out and asking the world if it wants to suck it. In other words, ask your lifting buddy if he wants to do deadlifts today. Hoping he'll say no, but he says yes. And now you got a deadlift. Face it, at some point, everyone's gotta die. It's like fucking Narnia back here. Bro tip! Always deadlift with a bro. Deadlifting alone is like trying to get pussy sober. You do not have the confidence for this. You're not gonna pull any tail and you're not gonna pull any weight. The only thing you're gonna pull is the ripcord and go home. You see me fucking murk that? Bro tip! That's my pussy claw. Who's picking up what I'm putting down here? Anybody in heat? Where are you gonna do your deadlifts? Theoretically, you can deadlift anywhere there's space for a barbell. And theoretically, you can fuck anything that has space for your dick. That's not an open invite to come over and jack off into my bath towels. Deadlifting in the free weight area? What are you, a fucking savage? What's next, you're gonna blow up a fucking hospital? Don't deadlift inside the squat rack. Then you're just taking up space that you're barely using. Instead, move the bar outside the squat rack. Out instead, move the bar outside the squat rack. Fuck. Now, you're not technically using the squat rack, even though you're taking up even more space and using it even less. The deadlift platform. An area specifically designed for deadlifts. But don't be fooled, you cannot deadlift here. The deadlift platform is high stakes poker. Don't sit at the table with your broke ass unless you got chips to move. Or you're retarded, like Rain Man. Alright, now that you found your sweet spot, it's time to do a thorough warm up of zero to four and a half reps of just the bar. Alright, now I'm all warmed up, ready to throw on some weight. So throw on your max and minimum weight. No matter how strong you are, deadlifts start at 135 pounds, which is roughly equivalent to zero pounds. Anything less is like running a 5K. It doesn't count and neither do you. Don't even think about touching these 10 pound plates until you reach 315. Okay, next is grip. For deadlifts, there are four ways to grip the bar. Three of which you should do, two of which you can do, and one of which you're gonna do. The first one we're gonna eliminate is straps. Now, straps are useful when you've reached a point that you can deadlift literally more weight than you can hold. Sure, you can lift heavier when you're using straps, but you know what else makes you lift heavier? Getting stronger, which you're not gonna do if you're using straps right off the bat. It's like using a flashlight for the first time you whack off. What are you, fucking inspect a gadget? Use your goddamn hands like a fucking man. Okay, the next one to go is a regular overhand grip. This is a fucking fairy tale, right? Your grip strength is worse than the claw game at the carnival. Any prize worth pulling is gonna slip right out of your hands. Take a hype guy from Scary Movie 2. I'm gonna deadlift with my good hands. Go ahead and say goodbye to hook grip. You found out about this way too late, and now it just feels wrong. Hook grip is like trying to learn a second language. What's the point when being first is all that matters? All right, and that leaves over under grip. This is your only dance move. This is your home run swing. All right, the only downside here is potential, you know, long-term muscle imbalance. Who the fuck cares? So now you're thinking to yourself, oh, do I have to switch it every time to make it even? What if I'm doing three sets? Do I gotta do four? I didn't even want to deadlift today. Where are the fucking dumbbells at? Oh, right here. Right where I left them. Oh, let me actually do these in the squat rack while I'm here. Alright, moving on. Now, I'm gonna skip form altogether, since most likely you are as well. Banging the weights, let's talk about that. A proper deadlift, the weights should be banging against the floor, right? You should be banging against the floor. Now, does this mean you should be slamming around 135 like you're working on the fucking railroad? I've been working on the railroad all the living day. No, 
Fuck off, John Henry. Making noise in the gym is a privilege, not a right. So unless you're pulling a bare minimum of 315, the only sound I should be able to hear is the sound of you queefing mid-set. When all's said and done, just shut up and deadlift. It's better to die on your feet than to lift on your knees. All right, everybody out. I got a fucking death wish here. Yeah, that means you too. Beat it. Off. Off the platform. Take your, take your bitch ass weight with you. Go. 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 Train's pulling into the station. Ah. See some of this? Pow. LeBron. Some straps, man. What? You got a belt. Anybody got a... Fuck it. I'll go raw. Ah. <laughs> Then it serves. Drop the mic. Hey. Oh, University of Miami. Welcome to Miami. Bienvenidos a Miami. Guys, hope you enjoyed the workout. So much more coming soon. Make sure you check out Matt's channel. Uh, check he's got out. some videos. No, oh, right. not on. He's got some videos coming with with me on, on there as well. Um, so much more coming soon. We keep posting three, three times a week. On, no, 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 uh, yeah, make sure you uh, check out my YouTube channel, follow me on IG, Snap Team, uh, Twitter too, uh, check out my Zanga blog post, download LimeWine, Kazaa, check out some old videos of me, whatever, man, you know, go to my home, talk to my mom for a little bit, hang out, should make you some food, Brad Martin, Matt Ogus, please subscribe to these guys too, <laughs> every Wait. Double thumbs up with the point, though. Oh, like the Dragon Ball Z character. Yeah, what? Wait, we gotta like connect. You have these. Like Doc? 